welcome to my channel. I hope all of you have been doing wonderfully. Today I am bringing you a back to school makeup tutorial. Of course, this is for both teachers and students. If you are something other than a teacher, it is also a perfect look to take to work. This is something natural, pretty, easy to achieve and I am using all drugstore products. Products that are very affordable and that I truly trust. So without any delays, let's jump right into this tutorial. Let's get this video started. So right away, I am going to start by priming my face with, of course, the e.l.f. Poreless Potty Primer. I already have it on my face. So we are simply going to blend it in. And this feels very pleasant on the skin. Moving on to foundation, I will be applying the Maybelline New York Superstay Foundation and my color is Warm Nude. I am going to apply the Superstay because it is the first day of school. I want something that's going to last me all day and something that's going to, of course, cover my blemishes. So I am going to start by applying the foundation, but today I am going to try to blend it a little quicker for all of you since, again, it is the first day of school, my friends, and we have no time to waste. Today we mean business. So we are going to very quickly blend. I am not wasting your time with chatty little rambles today, my friends. We are working because if we are teachers, we want to get to school and do things efficiently. We don't want to spend two hours doing our makeup. Not our teachers. And as you can see, this foundation is no joke. It basically covered all my blemishes and it leaves a very nice matte finish on my face. If you do have dry skin, you do have to moisturize if you apply this foundation. But of course, we all have our favorites. I am going to go in with the e.l.f. 16 hour camo concealer and I'm simply going to apply a little dot underneath my eye. I'm going to blend those dots out and then I'm going to set them with powder. So I am blending with my beauty blender and I'm simply making sure that everything fits right into the skin. Now that my concealer is applied, I need to go in with the setting powder and I am going to take the Essence Brighten Up Banana Powder. I am going to take my Beauty Blender, dip it in and I'm going to set my under eyes with it. So we need to set those eyes very quickly so that nothing that we did can crease whatsoever. And I'm simply blending it and pressing in the powder so that it can just lock that foundation. And since your sponge is a little damp, if you have dry skin, this is a very pleasant way of applying the powder, I've learned. Now with the normal fluffy brush and with the flower light illusion powder, I am going to blend the rest of the powder that stayed on my face right now. So let's not panic people, I wasn't going to go out looking like that. Not on the first day of school. The first day of school you make good impressions. And you try to uphold them for the rest of the year. Make good choices, students. And teachers make good lesson plans. <laughs> and now with the L'Oreal Brow Stylist Definer, I am very quickly going to fill in those brows. And I'm just naturally filling them in, just very quickly. So my camera kind of cut me off right now, but let's just pick up 
I was right here just filling this rebel in. Now we are going to move into the other brow and again it's a morning routine possibly so you just want to look put together. This is just a better version of yourself. And now I'm simply going to brush them up. And here comes the Essence Make Me Brow Eyebrow Gel Mascara to save the day. I am going to set my eyebrows with this right here. And this is just going to give them more life. And it does give them a little more volume on the areas where, of course, I lack a little bit of hair. It leaves little particles sometimes behind that, of course, make it seem like your eyebrow is fuller. And today's bronzer of choice is the Butter Bronzer by Physicians Formula. And of course, today I'm simply going to bronze my face very, very liberally. I am not going to try to contour because I'm doing this to save time to look put together again, just a better version of myself. And you just gotta love having some color on your face. Now I am going to go in with the butter bronzer and a fluffy blending brush. And I'm of course going to blend in this on my eyelid because again, we don't want to spend a lot of time on an eye look if we are tight on time and if we want extra sleep, but we still want to look put together. And gosh, did I apply a ton of pigment. I went happy just swirling the brush into the bronzer actually. I was swirling, swirling, and swirling some more. And I'm going to slightly apply some of the color right there on the outer part of my eyelid. Now with a pencil brush, I am going to take the same bronzer and I'm simply going to apply this color on my lower lash line. Very close there. And be careful, you don't want to poke an eye. I have done it. I am going to be applying just a very small line, just very close to that top lash. I'm going to make it just a straight line, no cat eye today, just something simple and pretty. And I'm simply doing the line right there. Again, we just want this to give us a little boost of definition. And notice I didn't take the color all the way in. I just applied it on that outer corner. I almost forgot to tell you what product I'm using, but I am using the ColourPop BFF Cream Gel Liner in the color Overboard. And again, I simply did a small thin line. Now you simply curl your lashes and you get your eyes ready for that mascara. For mascara, I am going to go in with the L'Oreal Voluminous Original, and this is just the color black. I am going to apply it on my lashes. I really love the volume this mascara gives. And the best thing about it, it doesn't flake throughout the day, and a lot of mascaras do. This one stays in place, at least for me. And then I'm going to apply some on those bottom lashes, but hardly any, just a little tad bit. For blush, I am going to go in with the Wet n Wild Color Icon in the color Mellow Wine. And I'm simply going to apply it, of course, on my cheeks. 
and then of course all over my face. And again, excuse my obsession with color. And I told you it would end up everywhere. But, I mean, we want it to look sun-kissed, right? Now I'm moving in with the lip color and I am going to be wearing the ColourPop Money Moves lipstick. This is just a very nice burnt orange terracotta color. Now to complete our look, I am going to be applying the Makeup Revolution Vivid Baked Highlighter. And of course, you know, these are just the products that I am using, but like I said earlier, we all have our favorites. You are going to use what you have. This is simply a tutorial that gives you an idea. When makeup is makeup, we love playing with it. With this smaller blending brush, I am going to take some of the highlight and I am going to, of course, apply it to my inner corner. And of course, to the highest part of my brows. To finish the look off, I am going to be setting my face with the Milani Make It Last Setting Spray. And you are officially ready for your first day of school. Again, this is perfect for both teachers and students since it is a natural, very pretty, nice look that you can just achieve fast and quickly. We've come to the end of this video. Hopefully you found it helpful or at least a little bit interesting. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe if you still haven't. Please do hit that bell button for notifications. Leave me your comments and requests down below. And good luck on your first day of school. I'll see you around next time. Have a very lovely day or a very beautiful night. Goodbye.